Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the very first episode of ASA, Ask Sky Anything, the series where I answer your questions. So let's get straight into it with our first question from Moody Meerkat. He says, what do you like better, clones or stormtroopers? Well, you see, my allegiance is to the Empire. I love the Empire, they're they're my favorite. But I'm probably going to have to go with clones because I love the Phase 2 Um like helmets and their visors and my favorite clone trooper is the bark trooper and so I love the empire I love stormtroopers I love death troopers especially um, but I'm gonna have to go with clones even though that kind of hurts me a little our next question comes from soldier bricks do you think Lego will ever release a new shooting system hmm that that's a tough one you know I'm not too sure if they will because you know we got a lot of good systems already that work uh or gimmicks whatever you want to call it like stud shooters even though i think are crap they they do work i guess and spring load shooters are cool um flick fire missiles nah they're okay um but you know so personally i don't think so but maybe in 2020 we'll see so we'll have to wait and find out Next question comes from Jawa. Do you want a 501st battle pack? You know, I, I like the idea of a, uh, 501st battle pack. I, I don't get why Lego won't just do it because that's like a ton of money to be made right there. Like everyone I talk to is like, I'm going to buy a hundred. I'm like, really? <laughs> you know, I don't buy more than one Lego set because I'm not made of money. Maybe someday if I have a ton of money, I'll start buying a bunch of Lego sets. But for now, no. Um, so to answer your question, if they ever make a viable first battle pack, I'll definitely get one. Maybe two just for fun and keep it sealed because those will probably sell like for a ton of money like 10 years after they've been released. So we'll see. Especially if Lego, you know, decides because people want it, they're going to be like, we're going to charge 30 bucks for this. Just watch. They'll do that. I am I bet you anything. Uh, so our next question comes from Ivan and he says, what do you recommend to get those amount of subscribers? Well, first I want to say, um, what amount of subscribers compared to a lot of people? I have nothing, but thank you all very much. Um, if you're subscribed and if you're not do so, um, you know, there's there's a lot of fake videos out there on YouTube that are like, do this and you'll get 100 subscribers in a day. And it's like, those are all fake for starters. Um, the best thing I would recommend is just do what you love. Like, like I, I, everyone says this, so you're probably going to be like, I've heard this before. But just have fun. Do what you love make good content that you enjoy if you don't enjoy making it then no like people are going to be able to just tell it's it's weird it's like if i made a video and i hated it the whole way through and then uploaded it even if it was really good in the eyes of the beholder it would just people would just feel the tension and be like this video sucks so you just want to make a good video that you like and um have fun with it and try to get people to subscribe by reminding them because like statistics show that people won't subscribe to your video if you don't remind them so um one little trick i learned is make your watermark that's the thing in the bottom right corner of your uh videos just be a subscribe thing you can't actually click on it to subscribe unless you hover over it and then like the little thing pops up that says subscribe um and it's just a friendly reminder for the whole video. Subscribe. It's like whispering that to you. So um, that's that's one way. There's there's lots of ways. I'm sorry I can't really answer this question because I'm I'm someday I might be able to answer this question if I have a whole lot more subscribers. But just best thing I can tell you is just have fun with what you're doing, and people will catch on because they're like, hey, this guy's having fun. He's really fun. Um, and one more thing I just want to say is try to add something different to your videos, um, because there are so many YouTubers that just copy other YouTubers, and typically when you just copy someone, you, it's like, why would I watch you? This person's better. So when you add some spice to your videos, it changes it up, you know, like for an example... Um, I try to add a little bit of comedy into my reviews because you don't see a lot of that and I think that's helping my channel grow and hopefully someday that catches on really big you know and so 
Um, that's just my, I guess, words of wisdom. It's not really helpful. Hopefully this answered your question. I rambled on for this question for like five minutes. I'm sorry. Our next question comes from E.K. Starlord. Are you going to see The Rise of Skywalker when it comes out? Most definitely I'm going to go see it. I'm super excited. I'm probably going to go see it on the day it comes out, like Friday or Saturday. Not Thursday night. That's not happening. But uh, I'm super excited for this movie, even though I hated the last one. The last Jedi was awful. And Episode 7 was meh. It, was, it wasn't good, but it wasn't bad. It was just like in between. Um... So yeah, definitely going to go see it. And I'm going to turn this question around and ask you guys, are you going to go see it? And are you excited for this movie or not? And our very last question for the video today comes from GS. How many Lego sets do you have? Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, for sure I can tell you the amount of um, reviews I have is how many Lego sets I have, which... Um, this week's video is video number 45? 45. Um, so for sure I have 45 sets, but I have a couple Lego sets in my closet that I haven't reviewed yet, and some that are still in their boxes that I haven't reviewed. Um, I got the UCS TIE Fighter, like, I got some sets basically that I haven't done reviews on yet, and so I'm gonna go ahead and just guess... A little more than 60? I think that's a good guess. I, I, I'm i not going to take the time to count them. I don't have like a million sets, but you know, and um, I only have Lego Star Wars sets. I'm sure if I look around somewhere, I have other sets, but I, I think I only have Lego Star Wars sets. So yeah, but anyways, that's going to do it for today's video, so please remember to comment down below so that way you can have a chance to be featured in my next video. The next one will be out, not next week, but the week after that. I'm not going to make this a weekly series just yet because that might drown it out. So yeah, so come back in two weeks and I'll see you this Friday for a review. And please remember to subscribe if you're new around here, leave a like on the video, yada yada yada. Have a fantastic day, and goodbye.